If Britain votes to leave the European Union, could others follow? This is a question troubling leaders in Brussels because the UK is not the only country that is facing a rise in Euroscepticism. In Denmark, some are calling for a vote within 12 months. CCTV's Guy Henderson reports from Copenhagen. When Jesper Morville first campaigned for Denmark to leave the European Union, almost everyone told him there was no alternative. That is no longer the consensus. In three months, he's gathered 10,000 signatories in support of a referendum. Jesper believes that's a sign Danes are increasingly disillusioned. So far, the EU has, hasn't had any answers to that crisis. Mm. Uh, or, I mean, the economic crisis started in, in around 2008, mm. and, and uh, the way they have uh, uh, handled it, especially in the economically weaker countries like Greece, uh, Spain, Ireland and so on uh, has definitely not helped the economic situation of those countries. Many of those signing up agree, though not all. That's like the pillar of, uh, of the democracy. Okay. Which way would you vote? Uh, okay, I don't, uh, you don't have to answer that. That's another <laughs> question. Well, I'm, I'm pro you. Referendum ripples have reached Danish shores. A poll conducted for Denmark's national broadcaster only this month showed that 42% of Danes now want an in-out vote on EU membership and that 37% of them would support the country exiting the bloc. The leaflets they're handing out here perhaps partly explain why this debate has become mainstream now. On the front it says... And particularly if the UK leaves, many Danish politicians believe a similar ballot may be hard to resist. If UK decides to leave, there will be parties asking for a referendum in Denmark as well. If they decide, which I hope for, not to leave, we will still have to discuss how should the future of the EU cooperation be? What kind of reforms can we come to with? This startup engineering business relies heavily on intra EU trade, and its owner says he'll benefit from a new EU wide patent system. Despite the benefits, Alan Krog Jensen wants changes too. There's uh, support regarding uh, advice, but still to, to file an uh, application for, for funding. It's, uh, it's a lot of work to do when you're one man in a company. So I haven't done it because of, uh, of all this uh, time it has to take out of the calendar. There is no referendum fever here yet, but beyond Britain, the temperature is higher than perhaps anywhere else. Guy Henderson, CCTV, Copenhagen.